and he beats you tomorrow and buys you Range Rover. The next tomorrow, he buys you <laughs> private jets. <laughs> Guys, he will beat you the one that he will beat you and he will buy you a coffin. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Kim of Plum by Kim, a makeup artist based in Lagos, Nigeria, and a YouTuber. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe. Yes, click on the subscription button below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. But if you're a returning subscriber, yeah, oh, what a darling! Thank you for coming back. Wow, guys, today is gonna be a big one. Today's um, a get ready with me video. I have girls day out kind of thingy. My friend is um, taking us out so. I just want to do something quick on camera before we leave. Nothing serious. I'm actually late, but I just wanted to chit chat with you guys. I've not done this before, so this is my solar water. And please, if you're hearing any noise, don't um, don't mind the noise. It's just generator. You guys already know we can't do without generator in this country. I don't even know how people are surviving. Me, I don't even know how I'm surviving. Because it's not been easy. Like everything in this country is just so difficult. Every day. <laughs> I don't know what whether to speak big, you know. <laughs> but every day now uh what's the colour? Grip day four. <laughs> like every freaking day. It's not easy on business owners. Cause we have to buy fuel, we need to run generator, we need to like guys, it's tiring. This Nigeria knows how to cripple businesses. Am I talking too much already? Hmm. My friend is coming to pick me, so I need to be fast. Guys, uh, I don't know, it's, it's been... I'll upload this video probably the next week, but this happened like two days ago. The minister that sang um, a coup in May, yes, if she, even if you're not English, you should have come across the song one way or the other. She passed away like some few days ago and at first they said it was cancer which everyone believed but later on family members or friends said it wasn't cancer guys the story is one kind sure that it was domestic violence and i'm like wow wow really <sighs> guys i don't know how people still we stand domestic violence to be sincere i know a lot a lot of women not even just women like so we, i won't be biased or something a lot of people actually go through that silently but guys instead of dying in the marriage and the relationship why not just speak out the whole thing is getting annoying And this woman is so powerful in the sense that her song will just make you repent instantly, guys. I'm not exaggerating. If you've listened to that equipment song, you know that guy, God is God is here. It makes you feel this um God's presence immediately. Like even if you want to do something bad the next minute and you listen to this equipment song, you just tend to repent immediately. You just repent of your sins. Me personally, <laughs> maybe people would be like, maybe you've not been in that situation or something, but I don't think I can tolerate <laughs> I can tolerate that. Yes. It's hot in here, please. If you hear um the sound of my fan, guys, thank you in advance. Because it is hot, it is hot. So from what um has been going on online. People said that she's been um, she's been responding this abuse for a couple of years, like a couple of years, and she didn't just want to leave because of what people would say. Actually, the dead can't defend themselves, so I don't actually know what transpired between the both of them and the marriage and everything. But if that was the case, like really, who cares about what people say? I I don't know. I know sometimes we tend to um, listen to uh, what people say and care about their reaction but when it comes to a life and death um, situation this is not the first time I'm hearing that uh, a, um, a husband beats his wife to death and all that so 
We know that this can happen. Why? Why? Oh, like, this is so, so painful. It's not like I know the woman in person, but she has impacted lives. She has touched lives, guys. I'm not exaggerating. Ah, I wish I could play this song here, but it's on my phone and I'm filming on my, my phone. I, this minister is so powerful and I don't know how she allowed this devil of a man to do this to her. I saw, I saw, I saw a post on Facebook and it was saying something about we all have a, cro a cross to be or something that maybe that was her cross. I'm like, are you serious? So people actually reason this way. <laughs> Please, what next am I going to do before I get carried away with this gist? So, my foundations, I'm not doing much, like I said earlier. It's, I just hope my friend doesn't come here and I'm still gisting with you guys and I'm not ready yet. It will not be funny. So guys, me personally, I've not experienced something like that. But once I'm in a relationship and I see signs, Sometimes people people um say you don't you don't really know until you get into the marriage or something. See, guys, fifty percent of the time, like people people see these signs. It might not be obvious, but fifty percent of the time, who see this thing and just die in silence. They ah ah ah. Mm -hmm. My husband to be a, if you're watching this video. I know that me, <laughs> I don't have any need to fight actually. I don't have any need to fight. <laughs> the first time I fought in my life, he gave me an everlasting man. Oh, I wouldn't even fight you. Nah, I'm bigger than that. Fight you, come back. Oh, once I just notice any sign of that, oh, let's assume I don't even notice him uh, in our years of dating and I get into a marriage. Probably uh, one of the days you raise your voice at me. Mm. <laughs> mm. I just take a time out, like take a break. So we both take a break, and probably no. Uh, <laughs> if you need to visit somebody or talk to someone, because you can't even raise your voice at me, not to talk of hitting me. And sometimes uh, this whole thing starts from the first one and he, he apologizes, buys you um, roses and all that. Guys, how? Like, really? Hmm. The dead can't color roses anymore. Do you understand? So he gets you roses today and he beats you tomorrow and buys you Range Rover. The next tomorrow he buys you <laughs> private <Prime> jets. <laughs> Guys, he will beat you the one that he will beat you and he will buy you a coffin. <laughs> you get it? <laughs> I know you get it, darling. <laughs> so, guys, like, marriage is not a do or die affair. It's not. But I don't know how this uh, generation, or rather, I don't know. It makes it seem like if you're not married, if you're, to be sincere, it's, it's really becoming annoying. If you're not married in this country, the way people talk to you. But once you start answering Mrs. somebody or so, ah, the respect you didn't even know was existing just manufacture itself and and you don't be like ah, it's not like this one that was talking to me anyhow. Like really, must must a, a lady have a man in her life before she's been respected? I don't know how you guys do it, but nobody can disrespect me whether I'm married or single. As far as you're not paying my bills, even if you're even paying my bills, you don't have any rights to disrespect me. <laughs> you beat me, I will stay. Hey! Because of what people will say. So, where are the people now, actually? Now she's dead. Where are the people? Like, how? This is really painful. It's, it's painful. If I can say it's, it's well. I just hope we all learn from this. Going to now that she's dead, most people are most people are blaming her like why why didn't she just um leave the marriage or something? So when you die, people will just ah put up a picture and do what say RIP and everything moves on. 
because this is not like I said this is not the first time I've come across something like this I think I'm going to bring some of my friends on my channel to, to come dissect this and know if they've had any experience or know anyone that has had any experience because we need to really just about this thing let's stop keeping quiet like no this can't be happening it needs to stop like, it needs to stop as soon as possible So another thing I hear people um, say is that they stay because of their kids. Okay, all right. That's nice, actually. That's perfect. <laughs> really, is that an excuse? Really, your kids? Okay. So if you now die, the kids you've been trying to pay for, what will happen to them? Guys, if another lady enters the house, most times it's either they are not kind to the kids or they probably send the kids away to their grandma. So why not just prevent what you can actually while you are alive and take care of those kids you love so much? than leave them in this cold world alone with their father and their new mother guys I don't even know what we can going for but I know I don't want something something heavy and at the same time I don't I don't know what I want to wear at the point I wanted to cancel today most times people think I <laughs> I enjoy going out but the truth of the matter is I actually enjoy staying on my own I enjoy staying indoors so that most times just try to put yourself out there to network and the rest I, I thought of this thing twice today, like more than twice. I'm like, should I go? Should I not go? Should I go? Should I not go? And finally, I guess I made up my mind to go. Maybe when I'm on my way or something, or rather when I'm done um, making up, I'll get the vibe because I'm not getting the vibe right now. but so guys i was just filling my brows here i need to fast forward it because i have a detailed brow tutorial could check that out it's on my channel and after that i used my um my brown powder for my eyelid nothing serious like i said earlier this is just a simple look and this is what it looks like we are ready to slay guys we are ready and i cued it as usual you guys already know now you can't get less with glam look by Kim. All right, guys. Thank you. Yeah, she's got some nice long hair, and you know that she's a bad chick. All the boys there can't help it; it's a habit. Clothes that she wears, short skirt and a jacket. I just wanna get her all alone on a mattress. I just wanna have it, I just gotta have it Rumors all around say her body is fantastic All natural, not a piece of fur is plastic Head to her toes, yeah they say that she's a lash Yeah the whispers all around say she has a reputation Don't believe it till I see it, so I want a demonstration And I've always learned it better with a hands-on education So I need a private session if you get what I am saying And they say that she's not easy, no she's really complicated But that only makes it better and it's got me so fixated And I'm not the type to wait around I've never hesitated But she's got me Hey guys I'm back home 
hey guys i'm back home like it's been um an interesting day and stressful day as well but i had fun that that's what matters actually so i just came here to end this vlog and to say thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed today's vlog guys you guys didn't get to see my makeup well in the car so this is me showing you guys that my makeup is still on fleek like it's still on fleek Who's your plug again? Tell me. Just oh, I just want to hear it. Who's your plug again? <laughs> okay, guys. Tomorrow is Monday. I need to get some rest. This this is like after ten, not like to eleven. Yeah, thereabouts. But as a glam member, as a glam family member, yes, you're expected to get one subscriber each week. So this is a new week. Go into the world and. Get subscribers, <laughs> guys. Yes, well, I really appreciate you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being here. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Please do not forget to like, comment, and share. The notification bell as well. Turn it on so you get notified each time I put up a new video. If you want to see more vlogs, drop a comment in the comment section, and I'll bring more vlogs to you guys. All right, guys. See you in my next video. Bye.